Yes, look, I've had things thrown at me that, that sort of others would, would shy away from. And I was always committed to delivering. You know, for example, when I was asked to lead the team restructuring General Motors in this country, GMH, it, it was incredibly heady. You know, the, the company was uh, in huge losses, and I, I say huge losses, and uh, it, it required uh, completely restructuring the company. Now, you know, others would shy away from it. In fact, I had a couple of team members who uh, thought that, that the medicine would kill the patient. People hadn't really exposed themselves like, like you do in an exercise like that. So we had to shut five plants and remove 10,000 people from the business and merge the manufacturing with Toyota and hive off the Holden engine company. I mean, it was really a massive, massive restructure. I saw the need, I saw the, the, the task, and yes, I delivered. I delivered to the extent that in my final presentation to the board and, and the head of, of the, the Pacific Operations, I said, and this board should resign because they've let this happen. How's that for a 35-year-old sticking his head out? But, and, and well, actually within a year, they had all gone. Uh, we, except one guy who, who was a good guy, yeah, he, he was needed for continuity anyway. But, but, you know, it's things like that when you don't shy away from the task. You know, even when you've got people around you with sort of, you know, wobbly knees and what have you. Um, you've got to stay focused, you, you've, you've got to stay true to the course as to, to what you're going to deliver. And you've got to make the brave calls. Yeah. Yeah, and that was a pretty brave call, asking the board to resign. Yeah, I, I've always sort of operated as, as, as if I was the boss, even, in, even when I wasn't. <laughs> in, in terms of advising you know, management, what's going on and, and what have you, in terms of making decisions that, that the boss would make. Yeah. Likewise, I've operated with uh, the people that report to me. I've always ensured that they had the same knowledge same context that I had because it's no good and, and I believe very strongly in delegation and well having good people yeah. but delegating to good people and and it's no good if if they make a decision and, and I say well that's that's the dopiest thing that anyone could have possibly done didn't you know that we're moving out of that product or whatever they need to know that so that they can make a, a good and wise decision and and not just spin their wheels.